go. Hi, my name is Amber Amon, and today I'm going to be presenting to you my marketing plan for curing Dr. Pepper Company. First, I want to go over a company overview. The company is the seventh largest food and beverage company in the United States. They went through a merger between Curie Green Mountain and Dr. Pepper Snapple in 2018. They now have the number one single cup brewing system in the United States, and they are they own and license 125 different flavors for your coffee and your soft drink beverages. The mission statement is that we want to create the power to be your own barista in the comfort of your own home. The company objectives, we would like to increase our sales by 10%. And we would like to increase our auto delivery subscriptions by 15%. Some of the, the strengths and weaknesses of this company, um, the strengths would be it is a well-established brand. It delivers products that are easy to use and convenient. Abundance of products and accessories for the device. The weaknesses are, it is known for not being environmentally friendly because you're using so many K-cups and they are recyclable, but still they've gotten some backlash about it. And products are highly priced. So now we're gonna talk about our target market. This is a chart here that shows you coffee drinkers in the United States. So coffee drinkers are from 18 to 60 and older. And it looks like to us that the main target here is between 25 and 59. Um, the reason that we would stay within this range is because the younger crowd, 18 to 24, um, don't have the disposable income to purchase the product, being that it's a little on the higher price side. And then the older um, group here, 60 and above, um, it's a little more tech savvy. Um, so sometimes it's hard to learn new technology. Now we're gonna talk about our product. So Curie Company has 55 models of the brewing company, I mean of the brewing system. And 46% of coffee consume consumers in the United States use single cup brewing systems. The K cups um, are what you would use inside your device. So that is pictured here with the device up there. Um, they're just a single serving of coffee. Now we're going to talk about our distribution. Um, there is a headquarters, dual headquarters in Plano, Texas and in Burlington, Massachusetts. And the Great Plains Distribution Center, for example, um, they have 17 routes daily with 20 stops per route that's delivering to Walmarts, Targets, Hy-Vees, big box companies. And the product can be purchased through their online website and through big box retailers. So the price of a Keurig brewing machine ranges anywhere from $75 to $175. And this is what I was talking about, that the younger consumer may not have the disposable income for the accessories and the things that are needed to upkeep it. The cost of a K-cup on average per cup is $0.50 cents to $1 per cup. And this chart here shows you that um, you may... Like they do partner with McDonald's and Starbucks and actually McDonald's cup in the store is cheaper than if you bought a K-cup um, to use your single device. Both are very convenient, so it's just based on how convenient you're looking to be. Um, in 2019, the yearly revenue for Keurig was $11.12 billion 
and that is a 49% increase from 2018. In 2018, their stocks hit an all-time high of $123.81 per share. I believe that that had a lot to do with the fact that they merged in 2018. So for promotions, they um, do some pre-rolled video ad campaigns. Um, the first one that's pictured over there is an ad campaign about it being so simple that you could use it with your hands tied behind your back. And they partnership with well-known beverage brands. Like I mentioned before, they partner with McDonald's, with, with uh, Starbucks, with Dunkin' Donuts. So they're promoting themselves within this already well-known brand. And they also use celebrity influencers to promote their brand. Um, right here, you can see an ad um, with James Corden um, promoting the new brewing system. Now we're gonna talk about the implementation. So our goal is to increase our auto delivery subscriptions by 15%. One of the things we want to do is when you enroll in auto delivery, we want to offer you a free package of cups, different from what you're ordering to try something new, and also you'll get free shipping for your first auto delivery um, month. And we also want to increase our social media um, presence. And we wanna add click, add videos. Um, the average person spends two hours a day on social media watching videos. So we want to increase um, that to reach our goals of increasing our sales for the year. And that is all I have for you today on The Cure Company. I hope you enjoyed um, this presentation and have a great day.